Hello friends, welcome back to Drew Tutorial and in this video I'm going to show you how to run a DISM scan in Windows. Guys, if you're having issues with your Windows PC, this is going to help you to run a repair on a Windows system image and of course help to make your computer much faster. Think of DISM scan as a doctor for Windows and if you've also heard about SFC scan now, these two use hand in hand. So you can use both of them when you're having issues with your windows. And what does DISM mean? It simply means deployment image servicing and management, right? So you can use this command line that is totally come built into Windows 10, Windows 11, that allows you to repair your windows image or repair your windows system image and files. So if you're having issues with your computer, you want to check this out. So what you want to do, click the Windows key on your keyboard or your taskbar, and you simply want to type in CMD. You'll find a command prompt here. You want to right click on that and run that as administrator. You'll have a pop up there and it will ask you if you want to run it. You just simply click on yes. Now there's three commands that I want to share with you that is related to this DISM. There is a quick scan and a more advanced scan. And also, if you're having issues, you can do the restore, which is basically going to do the cleanup. And these commands, I'll be pasting them within the command line, but I'll also be sharing them within the description of this video. So the first one that you want to use, guys, is this one here that says DISM online cleanup image check health. Right, so you want to run this, and this is going to go ahead and check to see if your computer have any issues. And if it finds some issues, you will go ahead and move on to the second step. This will let you know if you have any issues on your computer. For myself here, you see there is no issues. So it is basically telling me that it has done successfully and no component store corruption detected. So that's what it basically tells me here. So in my case, it is safe. In your case, if you're having issues, you would see. Now the more advanced one here is basically the cleanup image scan health. This will take a little bit longer depending on your computer speed, etc. I'm gonna quickly run it. So let's give it a moment for it to do its thing. So it's a more advanced one guys and you will have this run for you. So you just need to give it some time and allow your computer to do a check. All right, guys, as you can see, mine has completed. And in real, it took me just about average little over two minutes. Let's say put it around three minutes. It literally took my computer to complete the advanced scan. And as you can see, I have no issues there. However, if in your, in your case, you had some issues, then the next command I would like to share with you is the one that says restore health. So if you're currently facing issues with your computer, go ahead and do the restore health and allow this to go ahead and fix your computer for you. Keep in mind that depending on if your computer is facing some issues or not, and also depending on the speed of your computer, this might take longer than three minutes. It could take 10 minutes, depending on the issue. So you just wanna be patient and allow this to do its thing because it is definitely worthwhile for you to do and to run this scan and as i said this goes hand in hand with the sfc scan now so you can also run both of these if you so desire now guys as you can see mine is about 27 percent so i'm going to allow this to complete and in your case you want to allow it to complete as well and then afterwards go ahead and restart your computer 